geotag your photos with NeoFinder. Geotags are GPS coordinates attached to photos. That way, you will always know where the photo was taken. You can use the map in NeoFinder to add that valuable piece of information to your photos. This process is called geotagging and it is quite simple. There the map, that's the place that we need. So, my photos are stored in this nice folder structure, so let me first catalog them quickly. Today I still remember where I had taken these photos, so I will use that memory to tag them, add the geotag. First I need to find the place on the map. There is the search field, type in Utah State Capital. Find the proper place, it's, ah yeah, right there it is. Okay and the map shows it to us. We can zoom in a little bit and move around so we can see it better or more details wherever we need. Okay, there we go. Now then select a photo and use this red geotag button here. Then all you have to do is place the pin in the map, click on it and say right geotag. Alternatively, you can also double click. So Select a photo, say OK, add geotag, and double click on the map, and it will be immediately written to the file. This also works, of course, for multiple selected photos as well. So I'll select the photos, say OK, write geotag, and there you go. That's really easy, right? OK, there are some more ways. Sometimes you already have photos with a proper geotag, and you can copy the geotag to the clipboard right there in the copy context menu. And then select another photo, use the context menu again, and in geotag you can say paste GPS location. And there you go. That was also really quick. Sometimes the geotag is simply in the wrong place, like here. It's really off. So you can delete it with NeoFinder, again using the context menu, geotag, and then remove geotag. There you go. And of course, afterwards, you'll have to set the proper geotag. So, again, there you go. Double click on the map and bang. That's it. With NeoFinder, you can even use Google Earth to set the location, the geotag. Well, let's see how that works. Okay. Here's Google Earth. And we have a special KMZ crosshair in Google Earth. So we see the center of the display. This is the location that NeoFinder will use. Okay, so select the exact spot that we want in Google Earth. Okay, go back to NeoFinder, select the photo, uh -huh, the flag, and then use the context menu and say, here you go, set GPS location from Google Earth. And that's it. That was easy, right? Okay, so why do we do all the work? Well, we want to find our photos that way. Regardless of the name of the photo file or which folder or anything, NeoFinder can find it for you. Select the area of the map you're interested in and hit the Find button on the map. And that's it. And NeoFinder will immediately show you all photos and movies taken in this currently visible map region. And we call that cool feature the GeoFinder in NeoFinder. The GeoFinder. That's pretty cool. Another special feature in NeoFinder is the Wikipedia Inspector. Select it and uh, it shows you exactly the articles in Wikipedia that are placed near this area. So in this case, okay, we see that's the state capital and that's exactly what we wanted to know. So we know what's on the photo. And in NeoFinder you can even copy that to the XMP caption automatically. That's pretty cool, isn't it? With one click. So. Thank you for watching this video tutorial and happy geotagging!